How's it going, YouTube? Immortal Dragon Lord here, bringing you another Fallout 4 video, and this time it is... I've got something a little different I want to show all of you. This is not a guide on how to acquire a unique weapon or a unique piece of armor or clothing, not a quick way to make money or a way to build up a settlement to acquire settlers or companion quests or anything of that sort of nature. So, if you're looking for a guide on how to acquire anything or anyone for... Well, everything, for that matter. Oh, excuse me. Weapons, armor, settlers, etc. You're out of luck this time. But I will resume that at some point in the near future, so don't worry about that. I, I might even start it now, after this video. But anyway, I'll get to it at some point. I'm rambling, though. You're here for a specific reason, and this video is on what I believe is a speculation towards the new Far Harbor DLC that's coming out sometime next month in May. I cannot, I do not know for a fact if this is something that you will see, or if it's, I don't know if it's confirmed, rather, for that matter, if it'll be in the Far Harbor DLC, but it is still something I thought I'd show out. I, also, I saw this on a video made by fellow YouTuber Fluffy Ninja Llama, so if anyone wants to see that video as well, you feel free to, but I would like you to watch mine first because... Well, I don't have nearly as many subscribers as Fluffy Ninja Llama does. But anyway, this is just speculation, as I said, and in order to trigger this supposed speculation, you have to be within Bunker Hill, and you have to wait until two caravan workers talk to one another regarding how it'll be... One of the caravan workers will talk about her grandfather and refer to something called Old Peg. Or Old Peg, rather. But... Yeah, once again, and I'm rambling, so without further ado, here is the little conversation speculation, a supposed possibility on the Far Harbor DLC. Belonged to my grandpappy. Bravest son of a bitch that walked the wealth. That's a fact. He used to make the odd cat back in the day by gathering Marlark eggs by the beach. Bullshit. No, it's good money if you're quick enough or good with a gun. And he was both. But he stopped doing it for good the day he saw Old Peg. With his own two eyes. Old Peg? Is that supposed to mean something? You don't know of Old Peg? You've covered enough miles to know firsthand that radiation ravages all living things in its own way. But no one wonders about the deep blue sea. So one day, my grandpappy was egging. It was a foul day. Fog so thick you couldn't see your hand in front of your face. He was stumbling along, and then he heard a tremendous clamor from the ocean, like nothing he'd ever heard before or since. He stood still for a long time. The fog cleared for a brief moment, and that's when he saw the outline of the great behemoth. <clears throat> Massive. Bigger than anything you or I will ever see. Old Peg. A giant blue ghoul whale. <laughs> a ghoul whale? Yeah. As the fog gathered, he saw that great beast submerge back into the deep. And my grandpappy fled for the first and last time in his life. Ask any of the old timers and they'll all agree. Something ancient and terrifying haunts the sea. And that is it. Um, honestly, I didn't expect that whole glitch with the woman were saying the same things as the other person was supposed to. Little glitch there. I'm just here between jobs. Yeah, see, this person's a man and that was a woman, so it doesn't really make sense. But glitches aside, Old Peg is supposedly a a ghoulish blue whale. Now, there's no water at all within the Commonwealth except for well, essentially, out here. More more so from the region, from the Pridwin around and down to the wreck of the FMS Northern Star near Warwick Homestead. So, when I saw this, I couldn't help but wonder, is this something we would see here, or if this was actually something we would be seeing in Far Harbor? I personally do not know. Again, this is just speculation. But I thought I'd point it out for any of you who, who are curious about this. And that pretty much covers what I wanted to 
discuss. Thank you all for watching. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed this at all. If you have any thoughts on Far Harbor, D on the Far Harbor DLC and what you think about Old Peg, whether she'll be in the DLC or if she'll be something entirely separate, or if she'll won't even exist in the game at all, please feel free to share your thoughts about it. And only one more month to go until Far Harbor. I can't wait. I'm certain many of you can't wait. But Wasteland Workshop's coming first, though, so we'll worry about that. But other than that, take care.